Erin Hardigan was stabbed with her own kitchen knife. She was an assistant Orange County attorney. Right now, William Franklin is sitting behind bars. The Eagles finally landed. One small step for Neil Hackett, one giant leap for this family. There comes Barbie and Ken. Don't have an emoji for quinoa. <laughs> What if he's been in a boat race? So what if he can speak seven languages? Can he? Robert brings me these things all the time. Oh, I bet he does. I bet he walks on them too. 60 year old Tony Lorenzo Walker is set to be arraigned on Tuesday. The 19 year old was set to graduate from UC Berkeley next year with a degree in history and economics. His dream was to continue his education in Europe studying at the London School of Economics. The video shows the 44-year-old British tourist running into oncoming traffic to try and escape his attacker in the middle of the street of San Francisco. The mugger stabbed him in the head before running off with Paul's satchel, which had his passport, phone, money and bank cards in it. Paul Tam died of his injuries. The male suspect is described as black, in his 30s or 40s and around 5 foot 10 inches. The woman is described as also being black, having dreadlocks or braids in a ponytail and around 5 feet 4 inches. Edward Malloy described in court documents as a prolific pickpocket, the man in the overcoat behind the woman in the dark hooded jacket. According to charging documents, Malloy took the woman's wallet from her purse. Malloy has an extensive criminal history in Oregon, California, New York, Georgia, and Illinois. Malloy's actions and his prior criminal history show that he will continue to prey on commuters as they get on the bus.